Hello, this is Palico Padge, and welcome back to more RimWorld Alpha 12. And I have a confession to make. It would appear that you can't just wing it when playing this game. We're going to actually have to have a plan. Which is fine, but it has been, I've been doing a little bit off camera in order to make this episode flow a little bit better. Hopefully, hopefully. So, we have planned out here uh, a little section which will be for the bedrooms. They're not getting on too well at the moment. They're not too happy about sharing bedrooms. So, um, I figured, and the fact they're sleeping on the ground is a, is a big hit as well. So, the sooner we get those bedrooms up, the better really. And also, we need to have a crafting table in order to convert all these wooden uh, wooden, sorry, these stone blocks around into um, craftable walls and whatnot. So we really need to be cracking on with that, which I figured we'd put back here. So, oh, not too quickly. Let's go to number two. There we go. So first things first, while they're just building that up there, we're low on medicine and food. Hmm. That's a cheeky little squirrel there. Uh, in which case, first things first, let's get the food issue sorted and get those deaded which I think is Beatrice now they're called boomalopes that means they go boom when they die my only issue is there's a lot of foliage around here and there's a good chance it will expand and maybe come a little bit close to the base which is partly wood which isn't a good thing really whoa there we go but they will hold a little bit of meat, so it might be worth doing that. Oh, oh, you can get that as well. I died. Who's upset? Cammy's upset. She's just bored. That's fine. We'll, we'll get around to you. Uh, and then we also need to start mining out these bedrooms in order to make them happier. And then we can build some wooden beds to give them the uh, the space they they want away from each other. And we want one, two, three. So if we take, no, let's not take that out. Let's just take the one out and then we can build across here and make a little craft room. That's probably best. Now, I think I could store blocks in the area. So if we go to oh, structure and make some... And it blocks to there. And we'll put a little put a wood door on there, it doesn't matter if that burns down. And we can put a, a couple of crafting tables in there to get them going. And maybe make a stockpile with my zone area stockpile just here for wooden blocks. Storage and we shall clear everything. And put in. Well, what? Mm. No, let's just do stone blocks for the time being. And let's get another slate, granite. Well, let's get it all hauled. Let's get, let's get them out of the uh, the vicinity. Clear up some space. I should keep Osborne busy too. mining those out already that's fine need to mine that out and that out no that's nothing there no point clicking on that so food we've got five now we've got plenty of medicine that'll be up and working in a second we're gonna have to put a light in there if they're gonna be crafting what crafting tables do we have production there we go so we have a smithing bench which we're not going to need for the time being sculptor's table don't need that do we not even have crafting benches to start with do we have to research first oh that's rubbish okay well we'll, we'll put the research bench into that for the time being then nice to get crafting on the go straight away well i'm also going to need to look at defenses as it keeps reminding me down here usually that means that the director, the AI director, is, is uh, looking at throwing something your way pretty soon, so we could do with getting onto that a bit quicker. I'll speed up a bit more. 
But yeah, it's it's all going okay. I, I haven't got any quibbles right now. It it is a bit slow taking off, and uh, you have to bear with me on that. It's one of those things that once you've established and, and the base gets bigger, things tend to flow a lot easier. Whereas now I'm a bit slapdash because it's it's very hard to know what to prioritise without going too crazy. We will, however, some power through here because we're going to need a light. Keep whoever's researching happy in there. And now we can build a research project. So, what should we do? Stone cutting is the uh, the answer there. And they're mining up the bedrooms good. Now I'm not sure about... Oh, that's a good point. We only have the one animal sleeping place and we have two animals now. So, let's find... An animal spot. There we go. It's a communal area. I know you're not supposed to have animals, you know, no elephants in, in your communal area as such. But at least they're inside. Well, we've got plenty of meat, which is good. Oh, God. Let's slow this down. So we have a, a local squirrel going mad. Where Where is he? There he is. He's a manhunter. Or she is a manhunter. And she's going to attack Beatrice. Right, well. Beatrice, you're my best shot. So let's get you here. I'm sure you can take the old squirrel out and then go back to bed. Come on. Oh, god damn it. Killed the squirrel. Squirrel dead. Right, go back to bed. And hopefully uh, Lansdale or Osborne will get on top of that. Oh, now the elephant comes out. It could have been worse. I don't think she was injured too badly. Just a couple of scratches, that's fine. We have no trading capacity, which we know about. Beatrice is fine. She's had a plaster put on herself. Maybe we need to uh, start prioritising with the research. So, let's knock you down to two and you up to one. So, as soon as the food's up, she'll go and research, which is fine. The dog has gone doolow again. Well, we just have to live with that for the time being. Not sure what I can do with that, really. Like, when somebody else goes a bit upset, you can confine them, or sometimes it's because they're bored. But with a dog who's got dementia and is old, don't quite know what to do with that. Oh, now we have a heat wave. An unusual heat wave has begun. Watch out for heat stroke. In the rain. So maybe if Osborne gets bored, he can start hauling that. And maybe we should set Osborne to help build, although he's not at the moment. If he has nothing else to do, he can construct. So I'll take you to four instead. Because we're going to need you building here a bit soon. And uh, yeah, we might as well get all this hauled. Oh, he's been hauled. Okay. And this is it. This is what I was saying before. There's so much... Ooh, big lightning. There's so much to be getting on with. And when you've only got so many different uh, colonists being able to do this... Why are you in terrible moods? What's up? Heat stroke. Well... I can't really do a lot about that. Just don't go outside. Oh god. And Osborne has gone do that. Let's have a look. He's going berserk with his pillar and he's well he's he's gonna be making food for us, that's fine. Oh and now the squirrel wants revenge on Osborne. 
Is that it? Are you, are you calm down yet? You're going to go take on the rhino. Okay, well. Yeah, now he wants revenge too. Come on, Osborne. Is he gone, Dulao? Yeah, he's 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 maddened. Oh god. And Osborne is all the way over there. Okay. Okay. Need you here, girls. Oh, Beatrice is broken. So Lansdale has a knife. Cammy has a gun. Let's slow you down a bit. So, Lansdale, you get inside. Cammy, I'm sorry, love, but I need you to start shooting the rhino for me. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Get out, get out, get out. In again, in again, in again. Go away. Shoot it. Oh, no, no, no. Wrong way. Back in, back in. I think this rhino is starting to crack onto the uh, strategy here. Back in. Now, can we get you whilst he's distracted to go and get Osborne? Oh, no, no. Rhino's clocked on. Back you go. In. Out. Shoot. You need to hit the rhino. You need to hit the rhino. How is the rhino doing? It's taking a few shots. Medium. See, line of sight there. The rhino's clocked on. Let's play a lot of wow. Whoa, no, back in, back in. Disappear. Have you calmed down yet? Oh, right, okay. Right, you can go. The rhino's calmed down. We know Beatrice is broken just when we needed her. Good times. Where's Lansdale? Alright, so that's Osborne rescued. What we can do with him, I do not know. Beatrice is back. The dog's broken again. You see, this is what I like. This is what I like about RimWorld. You just don't know what's going to happen. So, exhaustion. So, Lansdale's knackered. She did go out a long way to go and rescue Osborne. Uh, we only have 15 full bars of food, supposedly. That's fine. Uh, we now have a disease with Osborne. He's got an infection. Hopefully, he'll recover from that, but... Well, he hasn't been particularly useful up to this point. And he's pretty much patched up now. That's good. But really, matey, you should be resting. Rest until healed. Just passing through. It's not really too helpful. We know that. A uh, group from the Trebo Olga are visiting the colony. Have you guys a doctor? Uh, 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 that does deserve a pause. <sighs> a group of pirates from the Kangaroos have dropped in right on top again. They are attacking immediately. Uh, Osborne's got an infection in his shoulder and he's not carrying any weapons. Great. So, right, well, 
let's slow this down. I know I said I wouldn't pause it, but there's just too much going on. Can't 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 be dealing with all this. So go. Beatrice. What oh, it's the bed. Be Beatrice. Ah. We got him. Sun draft them. Is he, is he dead? Dead. Yeah, Lansdale just strip. Who? Suppy. Strip Suppy. Yeah, carry on what you're doing. We'll get him buried in a minute. Is it he? No, she. And the visitors are leaving, they were no help whatsoever. Now we could really do with having some more wood. A little bit low on wood. That's mine. That's wood. Twenty-nine wood. Uh, we can put some doors though. Onto here. Start making the uh, the bedrooms up. Osborne's broken. As long as he doesn't attack anybody, that's fine by me. Let's get rid of these bits out of the bedroom. Camel hair toque. Shoddy. Uh, yeah. We should probably look at... A solar flare has begun. The intense radiation will shut down all electrical devices. Oh joy. As if we didn't have enough going wrong at the moment. And, uh, get rid of this. What do they come with? Oh, a pump shotgun. I don't think I'm going to be giving Osborne a pump shotgun just yet. He's a little bit squiffy at the best of times. And someone's travelling around naked. Osborne. You're a bit nuddy. Can you not put that on? Oh, he's broken still. Can't do anything with him. So there we go, it's uh, it's been quite an eventful one. Visiting the graves again, are we? Yes, okay. Let's build something joyful for them. Play horse show. Horse shoes, not horse shows. Who's ill? Osborne. What's wrong, friend? You really need to be wearing some clothes. Oh. What's wrong with you now? Extreme heat stroke. Okay. I'm there, where are you? Rescuing Osborne, thank you. Well, yeah, we've got the joy up. Osborne keeps breaking on me. I think, oh, at least we're going to be okay for food. Awesome. I think now would be a good time to <laughs> break it. Oh, there's so much going on. Uh, so, oh, uh, Osborne's died. That is definitely a good place to leave it. Thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> Uh, we're back down to the original ladies. They seem to be uh, coping a lot better than the the people who actually come from this rim world are uh, uh, coping with. Uh, so I'll, I guess I'll be seeing you on the next one. Hopefully it'll go a little bit better than this one. Take it easy. Wait.